autumn. There's nothing like it. The cool breeze, golden leaves, and pumpkins. But I like to fall for a different reason. Halloween! The blood, the knives, the killing. It's exciting. I mean, sure, I like Christmas and summer and other stuff, but nothing was better than Halloween for me. Halloween was my thing. And nothing was going to stop that. Or so I, so I thought. I used to go with my friends on Halloween and party and get high on pixie sticks. But now I stay in. Because gore is only fun when it's fake. Death is only entertaining when you know it's not near. You can joke about something and have the right to laugh. I can't. I can't even smile. The pain is still too much. You should know. I wasn't always as cracked. I used to live normal life. Had a best friend. Danny. She's president of the student council. Smart, but not in a perfectionist kind of way. She was a child your parents wanted. Responsible and respectful. I was polar opposite. Somehow we were best of friends. Living without second thought. High school student Amari Smith found dead in her home, cause of death, fatal knife wounds. Police suspect that the, her killer is still out there. So, stay inside, lock your doors, and stay safe. Our dearest regards to the Smith family. Rest in peace, Amari. Gone but never forgotten. And the weather today. Oh my god, did you see the news? No. Why? You know Amari Smith? Isn't she on the student council? Yeah. Yeah, I know her. She's dead. What? No. She was found murdered in her home, and police think that the killer's still out there. Oh my gosh, I feel so terrible. Her family's so sweet. I know, I mean, it's sickening. And the killer's still out there? It's crazy. Like, who would ever think that, like, something like this would happen, like, in a small town like ours? I know, and the killer... Do they know what kind of weapon was used? Did the killer a serial killer? Did they have a singular motive? Or do they- Danny, do they... a girl in our grade was murdered and you're worried about what kind of weapon she was using? Sorry, it's the true crime obsession taking no, over. No, I mean, like, I, I get it. We're all shocked. Hey, I gotta go. All right, keep me posted. No, no, for sure. Hey. Hey. You heard anything new? No. Just that Amara was stabbed 39 times, so whoever did it must have been quick detail. Oh my gosh, that's awful. Hey, we should go out. What? Where? I don't know. We could go, like, biking or something. Okay, I guess that would take our mind off things. Yeah, exactly. So, meet at my house in 15 minutes? Yeah, sure. And that 
English assignment. Oh my god, don't even get me started. God, our English teacher is so mean. Like, did you understand that thing at all? And don't even, don't even get me started on the map. Oh, sorry. Hello? Oh. Ophelia? For the very last time, I did not take your designer scarf, okay? It's probably just in the watch. Like, maybe call mom? I don't know. Yeah, I know she's in Vegas. I don't care. Call mom. Just keep looking. I didn't take it. Bye. Sorry, that was just Ophelia. Um, so how is Ophelia? Good? Good. Good. That's good. Did you hear? Hear what? Rose West was killed. No way. Yeah. God. I mean, I'm, I'm. It's not like I'm gonna get killed, but I like. I feel. I feel for her, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I have to go. Oh, okay. Um, do you wanna stay the night? I'm busy, sorry. Oh, um, wanna hang out tomorrow? I I'm babysitting. Oh, you're you're boring. That's fine. Sorry. No, it's it's fine. Bye. Bye.
engine side. So can I come in? Oh yeah. Wow, I haven't been here in a long time. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. School's canceled tomorrow. What? Why? Because of the killer. Val, that's terrible. That means no cheer practice for you and probably no pep rally on Friday. I know. It's just nice to have a break, you know? Yeah, I, I guess, but... People are dead. I mean, I, I'll be fine. I mean, I have this gut feeling. A gut feeling? You'll be fine, and you're not gonna die because you have a gut feeling. If you're not careful, you'll end up like those girls on the news. I'll be fine, Danny. Three girls are dead! Three? <laughs> Danny, three, you said three girls. Who's the third? I, I meant two. There's two. <clears throat> Whatever. You know, Val, it's a little suspicious that you're not as nervous as you should be. What do you mean? Well, some people might say that since you know you're not gonna die, you're the killer. Huh? As you flex about your survival skills, your actual rate for survival will go down. Uh, no, that's not true. Also, the only person I've told my gut feeling is you. So unless you're gonna kill me, I'm pretty sure I'm fine. I'm not trying to be condescending. I'm trying- I'm worried for you. Yeah? Well, I'm not. So, are you the killer? What? Are you the killer? You're not scared of getting killed, and you knew about Amara's death well before I did or anyone. I knew about Mara's death because it was on freaking news. And now you're defensive. That's a big red flag. I'm defensive because you're accusing me of murder. Yeah, and the break-in who saw it. Your mom. Yeah. Did you actually think that I'm the killer? It's not off the table. Jamie, I had to sneak out to come here. If I would have known that you would have said all this, I would have just stayed home know what to believe anymore. Me! I mean, I'm your best friend! I thought I could trust you. You still can. I would love to, but I can't. I'm so scared. I don't want to die. No, I'm not a murderer. I won't kill you because I'm not a murderer! Please leave. Hey. Please leave. You know me since the third grade, I wouldn't do that! What are you do- Don't make me go! I'm sorry.
Allison, how are, how are you? Oh, what? What happened? Mom, shh. That's oh. horrible. Oh my gosh. I had no idea. Uh huh. Mom, oh, I feel horrible. Gosh. I feel horrible. That's terrible. Is there anything that I can do? I just feel just awful. Mom. Oh my gosh. Mom. If there's anything, shh. If there's anything I can do, just please call me back. All right. Hang in there. Bye-bye. Mom! What? What do you mean, what? I'm sorry. I, don't know I, I, just, had, I just got off the phone call with Allison. It was... I feel terrible. I don't even know. I don't... Um, I'm in, like, in mom? shock. Yeah. I'm in shock. What happened? Um, she just said that Denny's sister, Ophelia, died. I mean, How? Was, I have no idea. I don't God, know, I feel awful. Terrible. I don't exactly. It's horrible. I have no idea how. I did. was just on the phone the other day. I couldn't ask. I don't know. I feel horrible. It's just like, what can I do? What can I help her with? I don't know. It's just like I'm in shock. I know you haven't heard from me in a while, but I wanted to tell you what I saw without interruption. A week went by, and suddenly it was Halloween. With a serial killer on the loose, I had nothing else to do, so I called Danny. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. 'Cause I'm gonna get in costume then. Um, thank you. Bye. We should go to the secret hideout. Are you sure? I mean after what happened? I I mean I understand now why you weren't scared. You you taught me you can't fear death. Yeah, something like that. Okay. I mean, you should have to give a house to my mom. Yeah, she'll be fine with it.
My angel costume was ruined, but that was the least of my concern. I told the police that the killer stabbed Danny and tried to get me, but I ran away. That's the story you went with, and I think a part of me believes it. Also, please don't tell anybody I told you this, because then I'd have to kill you. 